To find the number of atoms in Cu3PO42, this is copper 2 phosphate. Let's write the element symbols first. We have Cu for our copper, phosphorus, and then we have oxygen. For the copper, there's a subscript of three. So we have three copper atoms here. For the phosphorus, there's nothing written. So we assume that to be just one. But this two applies to everything in parentheses. So we have two times one, two phosphorus atoms, two times four, eight oxygen atoms. If we wanted to know the total number of atoms in Cu3PO42, we'd have eight plus two, that would give us 10, plus three, 13 total atoms in this copper phosphate. Sometimes you'll be asked to find the number of, for example, phosphorus atoms in one mole of copper two phosphate. What you would do is multiply the number of phosphorus atoms times Avogadro's number. So two times Avogadro's number, that'll give us the number of phosphorus atoms in one mole of copper two phosphate. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.